We have had the crates with tomatoes for over a week now and haven't made the sauce as we've been very busy. This is what I mean when I say that Italians know how to do things timely. Most people in town have already done their sauce, so as to avoid the produce to go bad. For us, there were quite a few tomatoes that had been bruised, damaged or couldn't be used. I think there is a misconception about the way Italians live. Some people just recall the times when they see Italians having siestas or having a huge meal. In reality, I think that they know exactly when to work and when to play, and understand that when it comes down to what nature gives you, some duties just cannot be rushed and some others require timely action. di questa per prendere le mani. No, 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 ancora si, ancora si riscaldano le mani. C'è la forza di Ercole qua. <ride> Aspetta, abbiamo più di tagliare? Eh, sì, no. abbiamo finito. Ah, Hai visto? Sì, sì. Poi si vede l'acqua, poi è più facile a farle. Cucina dopo mettiamo un altro po', che poi è più è facile a girarla. Fatto bene, ha fatto così, questo si deve lavare. Facciamola una a una. Fai così. Eh. Bello odore. Bello odore. Mm. Tu non ce l'hai il frullatore? Mm, non so frullatore, non so il, frulla il frullatore è una macchina come una bottiglia più è larga metti tutto dentro di vetro. e poi sì. per fare anche di plastica eh, di vetro di vetro, eh, di vetro si rompe invece quella no hai detto Michele dove è andato? Boh, mi hai dato questo pronto Quindi mettiamo un piatto che poi non lo so quando Michele la deve mettere poi lo dice lui mi faccio tutto così a una a una hey.
Forse un po' di latte, di latte. Eh, poco poco di latte. Tu vuoi anche? Sì, sì. Dunque, ah, basta, no. basta, basta, basta. Mm. Domani, ah, per Non serve, ne? Ma ti giù qua, qua? Ma così. Ma così. Ma così. Funziona. Tu puoi fare fino a un po' di più, hai visto? Ah, sì. Hai capito? Sì, sì, sì. Sì, sì, sì. Sì, Allora, usate tutto, tutto abbiamo messo, sale. Aspetta, che non va? Sì, sì, no, abbiamo fatto eh, un po' così. Ti piace? Sì, è fatto un po'. Guarda quanto abbiamo
Non c'è un giro, 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 non c'è The bottles have been boiling for quite a while. The reason why my neighbors put a cloth or a towel on top and then also um, on the bottom of the pot is so that when the bottles move, they don't, um, they don't break. And yes, you get the water to boiling point and then after that, wait about half an hour before you turn it off. I was told to leave it like this overnight and then tomorrow I will be able to take the bottles out of the pot and store them pretty much. There was a lot, a lot of cleaning to do, you guys. All um, the equipment that you use for the stores, all the tomatoes, skin and everything goes in the ridges and it takes forever to take, um, to wash off. Well, at least it took me forever to wash off. So today we pretty much made 12 bottles for one case of tomatoes. I'll show you the case in a minute. And hopefully sometime this week we get to do the other, the other case. So in total we'll have two cases. Hopefully we're gonna get a total of 24 bottles of um, tomato sauce. This is, um, these are the cases with tomatoes. We couldn't find tomatoes here locally at the markets um, because everyone is trying to find tomatoes. Everyone is doing the tomato sauce at this time of the, of the year. So there's a certain scarcity of tomatoes. So this is what we used and my neighbors went to uh where was it san salvo san salvo a few days ago and from there they called me and they said we found the tomatoes do you want us to bring them to you and we said yes so that was really nice so it is the next day the water has boiled, it has rested, the bottles have cooled off and now we can take them out of here and store them. If you enjoyed this video please give it a like and if you haven't yet please subscribe you can continue to enjoy my content right here and we'll see each other on the next one bye